Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to demonstrate how to control relay board using Arduino Uno and HC05 Bluetooth modem using Android phone. So this is my setup as you can see. So this is the relay board. This relay board is going to control the devices. These are the output terminals, potential free terminals, NO, NC and C. So you can see here the marking is clear. The middle terminal is the common terminal and one side is NC, the other side is NO. So when the relay is activated, one side will be will be closed, circuit will be closed and the other side circuit will be open. So based on the connection, based on the required circuit diagram, we have to connect our load on this side. So this is the mains line connection usually. So we need to be very careful while while working with this side. So this is the part we need to take care and below this part there will be live conductors, mains conductors, 220 volts conductors. We need to be very careful while working on this section. The other sections of the board they are working on normal plus 5 volts DC supply. So as you can see here this is the 8 channel relay board. The relay board is connected to the Arduino Uno. This LCD is not connected in this software version so I am not talking about this LCD. So this relay board is connected to the Arduino Uno here as you can see and here on the communication line the first two lines now the receive, receive and transmit, transmit lines you can see the first or yellow wire and the orange wire the first yellow wire and the orange wire they are the receive and the transmit lines. So these receive and transmit lines are connected to the HC05 modem. This is the HC05 modem. This is the HC05 modem. And here on the board you can see there are some voltage divider resistors. This is one voltage divider resistor and there are two more voltage divider resistors. This is because the transmit pin of the HC05 modem is compatible to plus 5 volts DC but the receive pin of the HC05 modem is not directly compatible to the plus 5 volts DC. The receive pin of HC05 works on 3.3 volts supply. So as a result in order to connect it to Arduino Uno we have to reduce the voltage. Arduino Uno is working on plus 5 volts DC. All port voltages are plus 5 volts DC. So here we need to reduce the voltage to 3.3 volts. So, we, so I am using a voltage divider network. You can see here this is a voltage divider network. I will show you in the circuit soon. So this voltage divider network is basically reducing the voltage so that the HC05 modem is not destroyed. So this is the HC05 Bluetooth modem you can see here. And here is the Arduino Uno and the relay board as I have shown. So this is the overall view of the circuit. So now I am going to control this circuit using Android phone. So as you can see here this is the Android phone. This is my setup. So on this setup. So on this setup. On this setup I am. I will close this app. Just close it and show you again so from here you can see this is the app I am using Arduino Bluetooth so I will switch on so here buttons now on this one when I click you can hear the sound I will bring them together So this is how the device is behaving. 
so now i am going to show the circuit diagram quickly as you can see this is the circuit diagram you can see here this is the voltage divider network this is a must because it has to reduce the voltage the receive pin cannot cannot be connected to arduino you know directly so we need to reduce the voltage that's why i am using this voltage divider network and this is the connection this is how we need to connect and from here arduino ports basically it is the pin number in the software this is pin number 32 pin number 3 to pin number 10 up to pin number 10 all these pins are connected here and this is how the relay board is connected directly we have to connect we can connect it directly very easily so this is how the circuit is wired so again this is the final view of the circuit thanks a lot thanks for watching